Hey guys, it's Gameface here and welcome back to another GTA 5 video and today um, I'm going to be going to the next mission which um, I believe is again um, similar to the last mission except it should hopefully be a bit different to the last mission um, and uh, yeah I'm hoping that uh, it can be a pretty decent mission again uh, in the last video I did complete um, one of Simone's missions, I think that's, how, I think that's his name, I haven't a clue. Um, but uh, yeah, I did complete one of his missions and um, that was pretty good. So we're going to go try and uh, get some more money because we've got like $400, which isn't good enough for me. And on the uh, GTA 4, um, I had like 250000 so uh, that's something I would like to have uh, fairly quickly. Um, but my throat is absolutely killing me, so I apologise if I don't sound the best. Um, but uh, despite me do only of doing two videos so far, um, my voice is absolutely killing me on the day that I really wanted to be able to record quite a bit. So uh, that is a bit unfortunate, but um, hopefully it doesn't sound too bad. And so uh, yeah, we're going to try and get to him. Um, uh, he's 0 0.3 miles away, so uh, not too far away. Um, but what I might do is nick a car. Not done that yet. I've actually not nicked a car yet, which is extremely tricky to do. Because I do kind of like this car, but... Um, it's a bit bashed up, let's be honest. It's hardly in the best condition. So, um, next time I see a car that I really like, I'm going to nick it. Um, so, let's get going. Now, I believe... Oh, I'm tempted by that. Not good enough. Not good enough. No. I've gone the wrong way as well, because I've been distracted by cars. So, um, yeah, I think we're over here. So, we've not actually been here before. Um, Premium Deluxe Motorsport. Um, so I'm assuming, well, this is the guy that, um, I think this is Simone, I forgot to pronounce his name, um, and he owns a car dealership, for those of you who don't know the storyline, and, um, I'm assuming that I'm good friends with him, I don't know, uh, that's probably why I'm doing missions for him, I don't know, um, to be quite honest, because I haven't been watching the actual, that's actually pretty cool, I like that, that's very realistic as well, um, because I haven't really been listening to the uh, the cutscenes because um, they are quite hard to follow sometimes and I couldn't be bothered as well. You might notice this car which I'm about to pull up again, um, up to. Um, this is a Porsche, basically. Um, they have disguised it and pretended that it's not a Porsche, but it is. Um, and behind me is an Audi R8, which isn't called an Audi R8. Um, same with all the cars, it's always been like that with GTA, obviously. Um, and you can see another fantastic car going past again. So uh, let's continue to uh, go to the mission. And um, I'm not too sure what he's going to actually ask me to do. He just said go to the house. So um, hopefully uh, it's going to be good. Hopefully we're going to be you know shooting some people, throwing off houses, you know stuff like that. Um, but at the moment, like I say, I can only play as this one character at the moment, Franklin. Um, I can't actually play as any of the other ones. I think there's Franklin, Trevor. Am I making up that name now? I don't even know whether that is right. Is Trevor actually one of them? Right, well, that was a nice little phone call between me and uh, Simone, I think it's that. Like I said, I'm just going to call him Simone, even though that's probably not his name. We have some very nice um, houses. Find a way into the house. Right, okay. Uh, so yeah, like I said, we're at some very nice little houses. Um, we've got to try and get inside the house. Now, I'm assuming we can just press X like we normally do to jump over stuff. Are you actually serious? God, you try and jump at a thing. Right, okay, so let's uh, try go up to this fence here and hopefully try and hop over it. No, it's not quite that easy, I don't think, to hop over um, the house. Um, let's see, can we hop over this side? Oh, there we go. Find a way into the house. Take out the gardener. Um, go to south and sneak behind the enemy when unarmed and holding. Right, okay. Oh, get owned. Can I pick up the chainsaw? Want to pick it up? Oh, damn it, I can't. Um, take down, so I'll increase the stealth start, which allows you to be quicker and quieter. Nice. Right, okay, so I'm assuming I maybe go up to here, nick the car or something, like I normally do. Maybe it's not that easy. Can I not get it? Oh, my damn. How am I going to get in? Let's go around the back. Let's hope that there might be a way in. 
So why would I open the garage? That's a bit different. Open the door. This is actually pretty good how you've got to go around the building and check out the different ways of getting in. So um, you might have noticed this from the trailer, but um, this is somebody's house. I think this is actually might be the guy which I'm claiming to be called Trevor. I think that might be his house. Uh, to reach the open window, climb onto the car and then onto the roof by pressing X. Okay. Cool beans. Let's go. So drive onto, onto the car. Maybe it's not that easy. Get onto the window, did he say? Right, I guess I'm assuming maybe this window? And how the heck are you meant to get onto there? So yeah, this you're supposed to be able to get from here. How the heck are you supposed to do this? You just climb onto that. Nope, not like quite that easy. Oh my god, I could seriously make a whole fails compilation of me trying to get onto the uh, the window ledge. Come on. Oh my god, I can't even get on the car and mind the window. Do you think I can break into it and move it back? You must just be able to climb on that. That's an easy jump to be able to do. Come on. Hey, there we go. Spend a bit more time on that. Right, let's go to here. Fairly easy house to break into, to be honest. Windows wide open. I recommend that you don't have... Oh, damn it. Damn it, this could be interesting. Right, look at the map. Look at the map. That is well cool. You can see what place they're in. Do you think I can knock them out? Right, let's just get going. Let's go. Keep on going. I'm assuming you got to get to it by um, going down here, maybe underneath the stairs or something this way. Oh my god. Do I have to knock them out? What's happening here? Mission failed? What? The family were... How am I supposed to know that we were in there? It didn't even tell me on the map. Ah, oh, That's not my fault. That is not my fault. Right, okay. Um, oh, right, I think you're not... So retrieve the car. Who's seen me now? The family was alerted. Wow. Oh, I quite like stuff like... Oh, wait, it's because I wasn't in stealth mode. I quite like stuff like this, but uh, obviously occasionally it can get quite annoying if you're repetitively doing it. Um, let's go into stealth mode. Start. So by L trigger, there you go. Let's sneak around the house like that. And we should be alright if we just do it like this. Lose sound blips on the radar indicate how much sound you are generating. What? Blue sound blips? What are they on about? Oh my god, I didn't realise that was it there. Right, okay, so... Ah, right, I missed them on my map the first time. Let's go, 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 go. Oh, well played. Well played, get in the car. Take the car to the dealership. Go, go, go! Uh, which way do I go? Which way do I leave? And it's opened the gate for me. There we go. Nice. Let's go. Oh, robbing cars for people. Hopefully I get a decent amount of money for this. Uh, I'm assuming that if I get it back in good condition, I'll get more than if I didn't. Um, so I'll try not to crash it, but um, it's probably going to be quite difficult to do. Right, okay. So if I ever go quiet, um, it's probably due to uh, something being said uh, rather than me... Wait. Sorry. Sorry, somebody's in the car. That's the other main character. We found him. That's the other main character. Right, okay, so then we can actually have a look at the hood of the car and the people inside it. Oh, that was a Ford GT. So I, that's the guy I'm calling Trevor. That is the guy that I think's called Trevor. I'm hoping that's right. Um, oh, it's the other one's Michael. I'm pretty sure about that. So... Franklin, Trevor, and Michael, I believe, are the three main characters. Um, they've eventually just... I've just remembered them. It's, it's all good. It's all good. Alright, so 0.25 miles away. So that's not that far away at all, to be honest. Wait, turn! I don't want to be... Alright, oh, good. Oh, right, so you double tap it to change. Right, okay. Cool. 
So yeah, I'm still getting used to some of the controls, uh, but I actually really think this is a decent game, well worth getting if people are still trying to make their mind up whether to bother getting it. Um, I got it off Amazon for like £35. Uh, it's now gone up to 40 so um, yeah, it was definitely a good uh, good choice to uh, pre-order it. So, it's been taken hostage, that's cool. Right, so we'll skip that bit. Um, ram through the dealership window. Oh, ho, ho, this is getting good. Right. Ramming through the dealership window. Here? Do us! Oh, yes! Ho oh. ho! Perfect parking. Alright, oh, I've got to beat him up. Oh, I'm playing as Trevor now. Ah, that's how you lock onto a target. He's pretty rubbish, isn't he? Let's be honest. He's not got a hit on me yet. Come on then. To counter, press B to counter while dodging. Ho ho! So yeah, this is the Trevor guy, I think, who has anger issues, I think they said in the trailer. So, I mean, smashing his head with the door is pretty extreme. Mind his bald head, mind his bald head. My bald head, mind it. Increase the strength, start with an armor damage. Yeah, cool. Hit him again, hit him again, please, with the door. That was a pretty cool little fighting scene, right? I'm playing as Trevor now. Um, sure, he's called Trevor. It must be called Trevor. I'm, I'm obsessed, I'm sure it is. So yeah, now I'm playing as Trevor instead of Franklin. Um, I'm assuming now I could change to either of them. There we go, to the switch menu. Um, and it actually tells you the stats of each of the people. So shooting's actually better um, with Trevor. Um, so that probably explains why the shooting was so poor with uh, Franklin, because it actually has different things. And strength is probably better with Franklin. Right, so let's get a car. Or a nicker car, probably. Um, let's see. Let's quickly nick a car. Let's go for this one, actually. It looks pretty much like the Audi as you can see by the uh, the logo on the front of it so um, yeah that is pretty much it guys thank you for watching um, this other um, video which I've been which I put out I think this is mission 2 or something mission 3 um, so thank you guys for watching if you have enjoyed this then go leave a like and subscribe that would be really appreciated and I'll see you next time goodbye